and welcome to the Archon tutorial. In this tutorial today I'll be showing you how to create multiple buildings. This function is available in Archon Plus 5, Archon Plus 6.5 and Archon Plus 7. So what you see on your screen now is hopefully what we're going to end up after the tutorial. So let's get started. So I've started a new project and I want to create a room. So I'm going to use the wall tool and select a wall and cl left click to start the wall and left click to end the wall. So you see here I'm just dragging the wall out to make a very simple squared room. Okay, now I've created room one and I want to create an upper floor. So I'm going to click floor, new top floor and the floor dialog appears. I'm actually going to keep default settings and click OK. So now I want to create an attic floor. So again, go to floor, new top floor and the floor dialogs appears. I'm now going to select the name of the attic and call it attic and click OK. So now I want to add a roof onto my building. So I'm going to click the free roof type and click the automatic roof setting. This will take the exterior of my walls and put a roof on top. The roof editor automatically opens and I can spin around the 3D preview window to work on each side individually. I'm going to make gable ends on the roof and I'm going to set the attic wall space to zero. Right, I'm going to click OK. So that's building one now complete. So I'm going to add a new building. I click new building and keep the name building to and click OK. And from the floor properties, I'm now going to select height above ground floor level to 50 centimeters. So building two is slightly raised above ground level. I'll click OK. And now I want to start drawing my building too. So I'm going to start drawing the walls from the common wall. I'm not actually going to insert another wall over, top, over the top of the common wall. I'm actually going to put a virtual wall in. So from the wall tool, I'm going to insert a virtual wall, which is the red wall and I'm going to drag it on the space where I don't actually have a wall at the moment like so okay so now I want to add an upper floor very similar to how I did it before so click floor new top floor and yep I like those defaults but now I'm actually going to transfer the visible wall up to the upper floor so I don't have to redraw it and I'm going to click OK. So now I want to put a roof on top of my building too. I'm going to click free roof type and then click rectangular roof and drag a roof over the top of my building. Again, the roof editor dialog appears and as I did before, I'm going to do very similar. I'm going to create a gable ends on each, either side of the wall and then set the height of the attic space to zero. I'm now going to click OK and there we have it. That's how you create two multiple buildings with a common wall. If I click the 3D mode button I can now see that I've got two buildings at different floor heights. Thank you very much and goodbye.